In this video, you'll learn how to recalibrate a bucket on your MC1 excavator solution. We show the recalibration of an existing bucket. In this exercise, we will also recalibrate a tilt unit, but the process works the same way if you do not have a tilt unit. This video covers the following applications. Excavator. We start in the main run screen of MC1. Press Tools. Press on the Bucket Calibration menu of the bucket you want to recalibrate. Here we select Bucket 120. Go to Next Page. This excavator has a tilt rotator and it is already selected. Go to Next Page. Measure the actual bucket length with a ruler and type it in here. In this exercise, our bucket is worn 2 cm, so we change the length from 1.8 m to 1.78 m. Measure the actual bucket width with a ruler and type it in here. The width has not changed. Go to next page. You have two options to measure the bucket angle, using a pipe laser or using a plummet. Many people use a long spirit level instead of a plummet, and in this exercise we select the plummet method. We make sure that the line between the bucket joint and the cutting edge is vertical. Remember that if you need an explanation for any of the items on the screen, you can press the question mark to activate online help, and then select that item. Exit the help mode by pressing the question mark again. When bucket joint and cutting edge are vertically aligned, press Calibrate. The calibration status changes to show the time of this calibration, so you can always check that here. Go to next page. Place the bucket flat on the ground. Press Calibrate. Done. Without a tilt unit, you would have completed recalibrating your bucket by now. In this exercise, we continue to recalibrate with the tilt unit. Just a few steps more. Go to next page. We need to know when the cutting edge is horizontal. Start by opening or closing the bucket until the first bucket image turns green. Then rotate your bucket until the second bucket image turns green. Once both are green, tilt the bucket to a horizontal position, controlling the cutting edge with a spirit level. When horizontal, then press Calibrate. The current calibration date is updated, and now you can press the flag to save and store. Press OK to finish the wizard. The last step is to verify the new calibration. The most effective way is to verify calibration in 2D mode. Press OK. Press Positioning. Go into 2D mode. Press X to return to run screen. Find a solid spot on the ground. Open the bucket and place it on the spot. Press 0. Close your bucket and place the cutting edge on the exact same spot. If your cut and fill readings are within 1 cm, you're good to go. Congratulations! If not, please repeat the process to recalibrate your bucket. That's it! You have learned how to recalibrate an existing bucket on your MC1 excavator solution.